preparing foods en papillot, which loosely translates to wrapped in paper, is actually another simple way to steam food. This French technique always manages to impress, as these little packages resemble gifts, and when opened, release their fragrant aromas. If you're having friends over for dinner, this is a very nice way to present food. And today I'm going to show you how to steam en papillote chicken breasts. First make a little bit of, uh, sort of like a vinaigrette. We have a tablespoon of Dijon mustard, and I like to use the grainy mustard for this, two tablespoons of red wine vinegar, a big pinch of salt, a big pinch of black pepper, and a big pinch of sugar, just for flavor. And now add, while whisking, about five tablespoons of olive oil for four chicken breasts. Okay, that's about five. So it's a mustardy vinaigrette. Now, to make the packages themselves, we have asparagus just picked from my garden. So about five or six very thin asparagus, the beautiful chicken breast, a little bit of salt and pepper right on the chicken. And you can put a spoon of the dressing. And some tomatoes some Kalamata olives, and oh, steamed artichoke hearts. And these are fresh. You can also use the jarred or frozen. Uh, some basil leaves. And a little bit of feta cheese crumbled. This gives a nice texture and a very, very nice flavor with the red wine vinegar. And now to make the package, Fold this in half, and to seal, you go around like this, and it'll kind of hold itself in a half moon shape, making an airtight package that will enable the food to steam and cook. Like that. That goes right here, like that. If you want to use the parchment with uh, foil, do the same thing. This, as I said, can be set on a grill. And you can just crimp the foil. This is the healthier alternative to just doing it in aluminum foil, which I do not suggest. And so that looks pretty too. Well, whichever way you prefer, in, in a parchment lined foil or in just parchment, aromatics and vegetables, meats or fish, steam perfectly in the oven or on the grill. Transfer this to a 350 degree preheated oven and cook until puffed, and you'll see when it puffs. Uh, and that takes about 28 minutes. I think our chicken is done. They're puffy. Can you see how nice they are? Look. So now you just lift this right onto a plate. And this is how you would really serve it to your guests. I find that it's awfully nice just to tear back the parchment, revealing the beautiful food, fragrant food, inside the package. Doesn't that look really pretty? Um, the basil, of course, has cooked down, and I would just add a pretty basil sprig to the top. Mm, I'm liking how the foil looks. It's a little silvery. It actually looks kind of like a crown. Gorgeous, perfect, fragrant, and healthy, most importantly.